Let's take a look at how we can create scenes inside of Toon Boom Producer and synchronize them with Toon Boom Harmony Server Database. Before you can do this, please make sure that your Harmony Toon Boom Server Database is talking to Toon Boom Producer and is synchronized. In order to do that, please refer to our other online resources or contact us on support at toonboom.com. Now, in order to create scenes inside of Toon Boom Producer and synchronize them with Toon Boom Harmony, there are two ways we can do this. The first way is to synchronize scenes that were previously created inside of the Toon Boom Harmony database onto Toon Boom Producer so that they can appear inside of our production page. The second method is to create the scenes from scratch inside of Toon Boom Producer and then synchronize them with the Toon Boom Harmony database so that they can also get created in the database. Let's start with the first method. So this is going from the fact that we've already created some scenes inside of Toon Boom Harmony database. I'm going to take a look at the control center inside of the Toon Boom Harmony database on my computer. You will notice that in the project that we are currently tracking, Roger Ses Humains, in episode 15, we have seven episodes inside of our Harmony database. If we go back to producer, I'm gonna to go to my production page and look at episode 15. And in here, I only have three scenes. So I now need to synchronize Toon Boom Producer with the Harmony database so that I can see all the other episodes in here and track them accordingly. In order to do that, you need to go to the All Jobs view you will see the list of all the episodes that you are currently tracking in that production. You're going to select the episode that you would like to synchronize. And you go to more, synchronize with Harmony. This will prompt you and say that it will synchronize the selected jobs and their scenes with Harmony. And all you need to say is synchronize. It should take a couple of seconds and now, if we go back to the control center, you'll notice we've got episode 15 scenes from one to seven. And inside of producer, I go double click on the episode itself. And now you'll notice that four more episodes have been synchronized and created inside of producer. Now that you know how to synchronize scenes from Toon Boom Harmony onto Toon Boom Producer, let's have a look at the other scenario where we would like to create brand new scenes inside of Toon Boom Producer and then synchronize them onto our Harmony database. For that, let's have a look at another episode. We're going to go from the drop down menu list over here to episode 13. Inside of episode 13, in here you can see that we only have three scenes and we would like to create more scenes for this episode. If we go to our control center of Harmony Server Database, you'll notice that we find the same three scenes inside of the same episode 13. So let's return to Toon Boom Producer. While in here, Make sure that you are in the episode that you would like to add scenes to, episode 13, and then click on the Add Scenes button. This opens up a window 
in which you'll be able to add the number of scenes that you would like to create. Let's create five scenes. Then we need to give it a name. In this instance, I'm going to keep the same naming convention. So 113 for episode 13. And then the number of the scene that I would like to create, which is 004. Subsequently to that, producer will create five scenes starting from 004. Then you need to choose the workflow, which is demo workflow for me. The length of your scenes, which by default goes to 60, but that can be changed later, so you don't have to worry too much about that. The priority of those scenes, which you can change from no priority to critical all the way down to low priority. We're going to leave it on medium for now. Very importantly, this box needs to be ticked. Make sure that Create in Harmony server is ticked. This will guarantee that it will synchronize with Harmony server database. All the other fields should be fine. We can now click on Create Scene. When the scenes are created, you can see them straight away inside of Toon Boom Producer. From 004 to 008. And if we go back to Toon Boom Control Center, we can just quickly go back to our episode 13. And you can see that all the scenes are here, including the ones we just created from 004 to 008. Now you know how to create scenes either by synchronizing from Toon Boom Harmony server database onto producer or by creating brand new scenes inside of Toon Boom producer and thereafter synchronizing them onto Toon Boom Harmony. Mm -hmm.